So next we're going to put Cameron on the ball and we're basically going to create lower body activation. And if you have a ball at home, this is a great tip that you can actually put into your own routine. So Cameron, make sure that you locate your body and your spine in a position that kind of mimics where you would be when you're standing up. Although he's not upright, he's still activating from the waist to the shoulders. Hold on to the weight and then activate your low, just your sacrum, your pelvis. So just a few like dead bugs. And what you do here is you really bring the low back into the movement. The low back gets activated, the hips get activated. And then what you're gonna watch Cameron do is he's gonna bring the larger muscles of his low body into the movement and activate from the feet all the way up to the quads, the big muscles in the legs, the glute muscles. And then as well, you will see as he comes to the top, he's working abdominals. What you don't see behind him is the low back firing and the low back muscles working as well. So this is a great overall movement to feel low back, mid back, pelvis, spine, and the big muscles that activate the power from the lower body. So that's good.